As China's leaders and President Xi Jinping meet this weekend, one of the huge issues confronting them is what to do about China's countryside, the farms, the villages, the farmers who make up almost half of this nation. Now, we're here in the far southwest Yunnan province in Guangxi village. We're here because there's a dispute going on between the farmers here and the local government. There are hundreds of these disputes all across China because the local government it wants the land to develop it. Local governments need development. It's the way they earn their income. The farmers, although they have the right to use the land, they don't have the right to own it. They don't have the right to sell it. They don't have the right to borrow money against it. They don't have the right to really profit from it. So if Xi Jinping can reform China's system of land ownership, what he can do is transform the lives of almost half of all Chinese, hundreds of millions of people, and that could inject real new energy into China's economy that could bring really profound change. But there are powerful forces working against change here. There's the local governments who benefit, the developers who make handsome profits, and all of those forces will be very, very hard to overcome. So land reform may not even prove to be something on the agenda when this meeting finishes.